Okay, here we have three different primer caps, three different uh, floats and needle bulbs. This one is the original, the genuine Victor, a primer cap, float and needle bulb. This one is ours, primer cap, a float and needle bulb. And this is another aftermarket um, primer cap, float and the two types of needle bulb. So they are plastics black and yellow so today I'm gonna to show you the difference between these three primer caps and what's the problem with these three primer caps obviously the genuine one there's no problem at all uh, it's perfect but only the only improvements with our middle needle is we change the the plastic into a, a middle one with the Viton tip and today what we focus now is these other aftermarket primer caps and what's wrong with this okay first of all let's measure the genuine primer cap that's about 50 millimeter now our primer cap also 50 millimeter now the aftermarket there's another aftermarket primer cap it's only 49.75 and the problem with this one is um, when you have a 2 millimeter o-ring and the cross sectional of 2 millimeter when it's stretch that that 49 won't seal properly into the body of the carburetor which what we need is uh, 52.45 so if we have 2 millimeter o-ring and a 50 millimeter uh, diameter primer cap that's roughly uh, 52 so now if you have this 49.6 plus another 2 millimeter of o-ring on both sides so that's likely to to leak fuel around the around the uh, carburetor body other thing is um, this one let's try to use the genuine uh, needle with the genuine float and let's try to pump this one okay well hold this one I press this one down and pump it I'll make sure that this is uh, close let's pump it's not holding pressure maybe you think that uh, I'm not pressing that float hard enough so what I can do is I'll get the spring so just to make sure that uh, we place a spring here against the float and apply uh, pressure to the float okay and then apply that still not pumping still not holding pressure why I'll tell you later why now let's try with uh, genuine primer cap let's put this one back let's try with the genuine primer cap let's put the needle and the float and let's do the same thing apply uh, pressure air pressure and we, we place that spring there so you can tell that I'm I'm applying pressure um, against the float so let's try it so it's holding pressure but it's not quite 
quite there. But at least it's holding a pressure. It's it's uh, pressure is increasing. Unlike the other aftermarket primer cup, it's not um, increasing pressure at all. So now let's try the, the difference and when when we use the metal needle, we'll do the same thing. We'll do the same uh, principle. Okay, let's put this one back and let's try our um, primer cap. Uh, first is uh, we, we use the genuine primer cap and we use our needle needle valve instead and we use the, the genuine um, float and we do the same thing we apply pressure here and the spring again place a spring here and to apply the pressure against the float and then this pump so you can see that's holding the pressure so that's the good thing with uh, that's a good thing with the metal needle with the vitamin tip it really sealed the seat properly and stopped the fuel from flooding and that's what what the most common problem with all the old big tires two stroke at the moment or not at the moment but since then so I really love uh, Australian Victor lawnmower so it is it is a big puzzle for me before and how we able to solve this problem so we come up with this metal needle with this idea it's uh, made of a biton tip And you wonder how I how I started uh, thinking about this uh, middle needle. I'll show you. So originally, five years ago, I came across with this um, Victor issue. So I think how would I able to resolve this issue, this problem? So I have this Zama uh, needle needle valve, which I'm thinking. Could I use this one into the to replace the plastic needle instead? And how would I do it? So ideally, generally, I grind that summer needle valve into a size of the, the same the same type of needle. So so that's why it comes up with this particular needle which is rounded on the other end and it's also grind on both sides this is exactly from a Zama needle needle valve which I cut into size and grind on one end so this is my original prototype five years ago which I used to um, replace the plastic needle and this will will fit exactly into that into the seat so let's let's try this one that time I, I didn't have the, the leak detector at that moment but I was uh, confident that it works so you, if I apply the same thing apply pressure in here with the spring okay. and that also holds the pressure and that's how I started developing that and plus uh, metal needle. Fortunately, I have a friend overseas who can manufacture the needle. And here it goes. We have all the needles everywhere in Australia and overseas. And improving the design with the crown type is 
is better compared to the prototype which is on, only rounded on the other end uh, and the new one is like a crown type so yes this is the story of how we able to develop the metal needle other thing is we also modify the the seat um, it's not you can you can't see it properly from here but that seat that whole day it's larger than conventional than the original uh, the seat the genuine one and why is that is to make sure that the the Viton tip will sit properly on the seat and also that edge of the, the front of the seat there is chamfered which uh, sitting exactly at roughly 70 degrees of angle of the tip and also because it's a lot because it has a larger hole the distance the height the distance of the seat to the surface is different it's it's offset so it's raised a little bit so to compensate the same so when you place a needle with a larger hole seat the, the distance there is the same when you place this needle on the genuine Victor primary cup which is, has a smaller seat hole so, uh, so you can see that 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 gap there is roughly that's 1.3 millimeter and also when you place this one on the on our primer cap that's not the right one this is the one okay that's also roughly um, 1.3 millimeter gap so when I use that genuine plastic on our primer cup it's roughly also has a 1.3 millimeter gap which is the same So when I when I use the the needle valve, the metal needle valve on the genuine primer cap, so the gap there is also roughly 1.3 millimeter. Now this is the problem with this aftermarket float which I, I'll show you what's the problem with this one. If it happens that you purchase one of these, I, I won't tell you where I purchased it, but I, I have purchased a set of these for 10 pieces, 10 pieces, which obviously doesn't work. That's before I develop my own uh, primer cap modified primer cap and uh, middle needle so now I'll show you what's the problem with this one so if, if, let's let's try with using a genuine primer cap and a genuine plastic needle and place this aftermarket uh, the aftermarket So that one is uh, is hitting that the gap there. It's hitting before it closes the the needle valve. Let's try this one with uh, with our 
primary cut so that's also heating heating there you cannot see any any gap at all it's just touching before it's closing the needle valve same with when using the metal needle as well so also also heating the it's also heating there before it's closing the needle valve and that's why you wonder why it's still leaking after replacing with a new float still leaking fuel still overflowing so that's that's the problem so make sure to purchase from the trusted seller or the, the, the seller that you knew that it works you can either use the genuine one or the aftermarket or aftermarket parts and also the other aftermarket parts now with when a, let's, let's check this one i tell you this one why, why it's not um, holding the pressure or it's why it's leaking and it, this is this one is even worse if you um, use that needle there with the with the float it's just touching there okay now we will use the our float is to make sure that we have the gap and when you apply pressure here not it's not holding it's not holding the pressure it's not pressure is not going up the reason why is there is a tiny hole there just right there just look on the the left side just right there Maybe we can um, see this one with when we apply with uh, water. Okay, let's. I'll be back and get uh, get some water. Okay, now I'll show you where that leaking is coming out. See that bubble there? So I'm holding this one here, the float, and while I'm holding it, you can see the bubble. So that bubble is, is going through that tiny hole on the side. So I, I once I rebuilt the carburetor and for a customer before, and I just can't figure it out why it's keep overflowing with this uh, with this primer pump um, primer cap so until I found out that this one is this one has a hole in it and I have 10 of those exactly the same and I'm pretty sure that this this type of primer cap or this batch is still on the market so it's up to you how you choose where the, which one switch okay let's go back and try this uh, two different types of plastic needle and what it does so you, with the genuine primer cap using the genuine primer cap we, use, we try this uh, yellow needle um, this one is has to be faced towards the inside and the round one is towards the float okay now you can see that the the gap is way too far and it's almost touching on the the base of the the side of the carby around here sorry that's the wrong one so around here
So I, I saw that the problem the problem for this on Y is not sitting properly and obviously it won't uh, hold the pressure at all. So if we if we test this one it's not holding pressure at all. It's not holding. It's not pressure. is not going up at all. And the reason the reason for this one is um, this part here. Uh, these three corners here on on the tip of the the needle is is sitting on the on the outside of the the seat and preventing the the tip of the needle from going in so it's it's like a, a tripod the leg of the tripod that's the sitting on top of the, the seat so that's the problem with this one the black one looks the same idea the same the same thing let's try what it does The gap is also way too far, and it's not it's not that bad. Let's try this. Let's put a spring there to push that. So that one is not bad. It's it's sitting. It's not like a, the other one, the yellow one. It's like a tripod. This one is sitting, but it's the the pressure is dropping um, immediately. So that means that you can this one can run, but you can't leave the the mower uh, sitting with the tap open. It will floods. It will floods the carby because that 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 sign day is that means the fuel is still going through the seat so this this type of needle doesn't see it properly doesn't see it properly so I think we cover all most of the, the issue with uh, different types of primer caps different types of uh, floats different types of needle and how do we know which one uh, which one's the right one or how do we know where to purchase the right one? The answer is, we don't know. We don't know. So, because you can't tell from the appearance, they are all exactly the same. They are all exactly the same. So the only thing is buy from the reputable seller and the sellers that you know that it's working. Thanks for watching.